there's a proliferation of, of innovation in ophthalmology, which is wonderful. But for early stage companies, there's usually, there's certainly need for financing and, and most look to be acquired at some point uh, by an ophthalmic strategic. And VCs have been lamenting that the pool of ophthalmic strategics has been shrinking, Novartis exiting, Allergan you know, being part of, of Abvi, a much larger company. And so wondering, are there enough strategics to take care of the amazing innovation happening? And the, uh, most people know about the Iveric deal that was just done, the $5.9 billion, the biggest M&A transaction in ophthalmology this past year. And one very interesting thing about it was that most people were not thinking of Astellas as a strategic that would require uh, and do an ophthalmology deal at that point. So I think it was a very good thing for ophthalmology because it really, I think, you know, opened our minds about, you know, who is a strategic, who would be capable of supporting ophthalmology and doing a large M&A deal. And uh, so that was, it was the biggest M&A deal in ophthalmology this past year. And I think it sort of, it was a, a very, very positive thing for ophthalmology in general.